This view into my private frickin' life is a non-profit fan-made parody. Full Metal Alchemist, Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, The Conqueror of Shambhala, and The Sacred Star of Milos are all owned by Studio Bones, Madman Entertainment, Anime Limited, Aniplex of America, and Hiromu Arakawa. Please support the official release, or I don't get my arm back. Or my leg. And Al doesn't get his body back. And basically a whole lot of really horrible crap happens, so just watch the freaking show, alright? We join our heroes Edward and Alphonse today on their adventure to Lior. Ever on their quest for the Philosopher's Stone, they hope to- Wait. Why are they going to Lior? What do you mean the star in the story here? This is like nine episodes in! Oh my god! This is already a treasure! Brother, the voice is back. The voice that tells you that society is an anthill slowly cannibalizing itself and that death would be a mercy for them all. I... I don't have a voice like... that. <laughs> yeah, me neither. You know, the voice that narrates everything we do- Finally, we're at Lior. Brother, the voice is really starting to scare me. I promise, Al. If there's a Philosopher's Stone here, we'll find it. No matter how many bodies it takes. <sighs> so we're just not gonna talk about my thing then. Okay. What thing? Uh, do we at least have a plan this time? Oh, I have a plan. I always have a plan. <laughs> Can we at least try not to start a holy war this time? Boys, what's your poison? Slippery nipple, sex on the beach, angel's tit. He's underage and I'm a suit of armor. Do you have any oil, maybe? No, but I've got a screwdriver. So, what brings you boys to Lior? We're actually looking for something called a philosopher's stone. Sorry boys, I'm a bit too old for the Harry Potters, but maybe this teenager can help you out. Hi, my name's Rose. How can I help? We're actually looking for a philosopher's stone. Have you seen any? Oh, I'm sorry. Father Cornello doesn't let us read the Devil's mm -hmm. books. Oh, sweet Tesla, you're one of those. One of what, little girl? One of those punk rock for Jesus types. Flowing sundress, dyed pink highlights, definite daddy issues. Oh no, I'd never dye my hair. The Lord says my body is a temple and to keep it pure. Aw, that's cute. You have an imaginary friend. Did you just compare my lord and savior to the schizophrenic hallucinations of lonely children? <sighs> Can't see or hear him, yet you still talk to him and ask for guidance. Not seeing the difference here, Betty Bible. It's called faith. Never heard of it. You know what I believe in Jonestown? Science. Because even if you don't believe in it, it's still real. Then use science to explain that. Now this here is a dead bird. We give it a shake and a squeeze, say a little prayer on our knees in Africa. Jesus, praise the Lord, it's alive again. Give me money. Dehydrated bird. Wh what? Dehydrated bird. Just add water. How would that even work? I don't know, Mary. I'm an alchemist, not an orna... orna... bird... scientist guy. I think you're looking for ornithologist? No, pretty sure that's a vagina doctor. What's a vagina? So what you're saying is that you don't have the answer, but you believe that someone with more knowledge than you does? You know what that's called? Faith. I'm gonna destroy that bitch's entire belief system. Dear Lord, please purge my impure thoughts and forgive me for dyeing my hair and desecrating your holy temple with filthy bright colors. Ha <laughs> I fucking knew it. What are you doing in the house of the Lord? Making corrections in all the Bibles. You're what? Don't worry, Holy Roller. I'm just changing a few things, like the size of Noah's Ark, adding the dinosaurs, and tearing out that Genesis crap. <gasps> Don't you know that's an affront to the Holy Father? You'll be sent to hell. Citric acid. 
calcium phosphate, salt, and maltodextrin, ascorbic acid, butylated hydroxyanazole, 15 other assorted flavors and colors, and cyanide. What is that? Oh, you don't recognize the ingredients? I figured I'd just let you know what's in the Kool-Aid that Father Connello is feeding you morons. He's not- I saw the giant fountain outside. Oh. Brother, be nice to Rose. She's kind, and she's pretty, and she smells like sunsets! <sighs> fine. I'm sorry you're a moron, Eve. Notice me, senpai! <laughs> Get back here! You can't run away from your stupidity! Where's Jesus when you need him? <sighs> knock knock, we're Newton's witnesses. Have you found science? Maybe she got raptured. Oh no, wait, there she is! And what is going on over here? The unbelievers are destroying the holy text with their lies. Smite them. Smite them with your righteous vengeance and crucify them like Jesus did the heathens in Narnia. Did you even read this? Everyone in Lior is illiterate. Except for Father Cornello. And there it is. Now, now, Rose, was it not as I said? I see it all now. No. Yes, everything. Dear God, and with the no. sacrifice, just, the demon will stop. swallow up the land. I knew this day would come, no, and the task please. is almost finished. There are only two left I doubt it. to seal this town to the abyss, the mark of Samuel. When it's completed, all is lost. Uh, doubtful. Even in daytime, darkness will cover the sun. No. The dead will walk, and martyrs will burn in the fires of hell. Uh-uh. Everyone will die. Don't think so. Just as the good book tells us. That's Silent Hill. I find your lack of faith. Disturbing, boy. And that's Star Wars. Jeez, you're really unoriginal, aren't you? Alright, that's it. Unleash the Chimera. Yes, Aslan! Eat the small child! Aslan? Really? Well, at least he's stuck with Narnia. <clears throat> what? Hi! Auto mail! I see. Landerball! Attack his leg! <clears throat> Seriously, you have to stop watching movies. Consider this an intervention! Oh, you've gotta be fucking kidding me with that! <clears throat> I see. So you're the one they call the Full Metal Alchemist. Actually, the other one should be called Full Metal because he's a giant suit of armor. Shut the f up, Floyd. I hear you boys tried human transmutation. Yep, yep, yep. I hear it cost you an arm and a leg. Okay, fuck this. This here's called my holy gun, and do you know why? Because you make holes with it? No, actually, it's because years ago a man came down from the heavens and blessed each bullet. Of course it's because I make holes with it! Delightful. Also, thanks for proving what I've been trying to tell everyone. And what pray tell is that? That those aren't miracles you've been performing. You've been using alchemy. Never heard of it. Huh. So that's what that feels like. But we both know you're full of shit. Just listen to the sound. The sound? The sound. The alchemy sound. <laughs> that sounds nothing like my miracles! Holy shit, the little Aryan was right! God damn it! Watch your mouth! I'm sorry, father. No, wait, fuck you! You told me you could bring back my dead boyfriend, you fat fuck! Oh, cock blocked by the dead boyfriend. Sorry, Al. Uh, it's not the first time someone dead ruined my life. You know, it just now occurs that there has been quite a bit of talking and not nearly enough shooting. <laughs> You might be able to kill my chimeras, but you'll never be able to destroy what I stand for! I am more than just a man to these people! I am an idea! You can't kill an idea, boy! God sees the heathen in his suit of armor! Our ignorance is bliss, you bastard! I'm gonna give this kid an ass full of faith. I'm gonna cut out the big one and live inside the body! For Frodo! Now, how are these boys gonna survive this? Spoiler alert, they are not. They gonna die in the next episode. Full Metal Bridge, two episodes long, Cornetto wins. Mmm, don't you like the sound of that? <laughs>